The aim of the Atlantic Future is to study the rationales of cooperation in the Atlantic area and to suggest strategies to the EU on how to engage with the wider transatlantic relationship. It is a three-year collaborative research project funded by the European Commission under the 7th Framework Programme, developed by a consortium of 13 partners from the four regions of the Atlantic and coordinated by SIDOB during a period of 36 months from January 2013 to December 2015. In a context of a spectacular growth in Asia and the Pacific Rim, the Atlantic space is experiencing a major reconfiguration. The North America-Europe link continues to be the strongest and largest between any two continents. But their decline in relative terms is slowly being matched by the rise of Africa and Latin America, all of which are increasing their interregional links and gaining weight in global affairs. The main goal of the Atlantic future is to analyse fundamental trends in the Atlantic Basin and to show how changing economic, financial, security, human, political, cultural, energy and environmental links are transforming the wider Atlantic space. Five aims guide the research. Understanding the Atlantic, what we mean by Atlantic space and Atlantic Basin, how we relate it to leading concepts and phenomena in global affairs, and how we place this in context, not just in research and scientific disciplines, but also in policy agendas. Mapping change. Change in the relative weights of the Atlantic players in a large number of issues. Impact of global phenomena on the region and variations in the links and flows between regions of the Atlantic. Collecting perspectives from all four continents around the Atlantic, big powers to smaller states, and stakeholders of different nature. Projecting trends, focusing on the key actors and factors shaping them, building scenarios, outlining a research and policy agenda for the future of the region. Identifying opportunity, potential of Atlantic cooperation in addressing global challenges, opportunities for EU foreign policy and for the agendas of other major Atlantic players, connecting initiatives that are building pan-Atlantic epistemic communities. How are we going to achieve these goals? These will be our main tools. We'll generate data sets. We'll collect data in all the main fields such as economy and finance, security, people and institutions, and resources and environment. We'll build an interactive atlas. It will be a visualization of the main trends in the thematic areas of the project. We'll interview more than 400 relevant actors and we'll create the Atlantic 500 a virtual community that will bring together stakeholders across the Atlantic. We'll generate instruments for a better understanding of the Atlantic space and its potential to create opportunity for the specific foreign policy agendas of Atlantic actors. We'll analyse dynamics in interregional links, studying the evolution of region-to-region -region relations. The Atlantic Future Project will answer whether a new pan-Atlantic system of relations is really emerging in the Atlantic area and will outline possible future scenarios for policymakers to consider when deciding on the future of this region.